I'm so slack. Hi, everybody. Thanks for joining us here on Geek Tech Industries live stream. Stick is here. Valley here. And uh, a happy gunboat day. Merry gunboats to everyone. Happy gunboat to you all. So, uh, today, of course, is the launch of uh, Wave 13. And technically 13 and a half with the, the uh, new uh, Last Jedi ships launching today as well. 13, good lord. I know, right? 13 waves later. We're still playing and having fun. Who knew? Crazy. So, yeah. Uh, 13 waves. So, uh, I hope everybody got a chance to pick up the ships they wanted before they went out of stock, and we have to wait another year before they refill. Valley didn't. Not, not yet. IBC still got a bunch. But his good buddy Stick has hooked him up a little bit. I did a little. Yeah. Because I was like, man... Man, I can't, I can't, I'm getting nothing from this wave. I can't do that. So I'm not SOL. No. So I went out and I actually picked up um, <laughs> one of the silencer, <laughs> one of the bomber, one of the new Phantom, uh, one of the Kimogila, which I'm excited to fly, and two gunboats. Because gunboat! I think they were kind of crazy to release so many at once. Yeah. I mean, I know it's beating the Christmas season and all, but so many, like, that's wasn't, a heavy hit on It wasn't originally wallets. the plan. It wasn't originally the plan. This wave was originally pushed back, I think, until after Christmas, but they uh, they arrived early. So, hey, why not? Let's just sling them out to everybody and make your wallets cry extra hard in the Christmas time. Yeah. Yeah. So, now, unfortunately, <laughs> I picked them up this evening, sort of late this afternoon, and I haven't had a time chance to open any of them. No, you haven't. I uh, at all. Well, you haven't made the chance to open it. Uh, that's true. I, I, we would have been even later if I had done. Meanwhile, that. I yeah. arrived here. You gave me one. I immediately broke it open, built a list, and that's what I'm going to die with right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready to die. Uh, so, so I will like to. I would like to say thank you very much uh, for uh, the list. That you suggested today, we are going to fly something very similar or proxied uh, in the second uh, game tonight. Because we just don't have the ships. I just don't. I don't got it. It's I don't got it to fly. It's the new stuff, and we don't have it yet. But, Not all of but it. But David, we will fly your list tonight, or or something a fair, reasonable, super similar, a reasonable to. facsimile thereof. Yeah. In the meantime, Bally and I have. Uh, well, Bally busted out a list using the new Tide Silencer. And combined with the old school Phantom, you want to pop us over? And I guess yeah, I'm gonna I can pop us over. I can you yammer can talk. about it for a minute. You can yammer about yours. There you go. So there's Bally's list. So Let's see what he's got. I'm running Whisper in the Phantom with a pretty standard Whisper build: advanced cloaking, fire control systems, the eye, and got Agent Callus on there for Solid a little whisper. bit of support. Um, then this lovely tie silencer. Goddamn thing's huge! Blackout is my pilot of choice. Okay. There's only two aces, Blackout and Kylo Ren. As neat as Kylo Ren is and running at nines all nice and good, but Blackout! Oh my lord, this pilot skill! <laughs> He's on seven, and anytime he is shooting through debris at his opponent, the defender is at minus two defense dice. To a minimum of zero. Yep. I got trick shot on him. Yep. I know. I, I mean, know. obviously, that, that probably comes to most people's mind immediately. That's like the and it came thought. to my mind, and I'm doing it. I like it. I'm running the advanced optics, the new uh, the new uh, advanced optics. Hold your focus. Hold yep. your focus. Auto thrusters, the new t uh, title that goes with it, first order vanguard. So mm. if my opponent that I am shooting is the only target... That I can shoot at range one to three, then I may reroll one attack die. Uh, advanced sensors. Yes, very important for repositioning to get out from behind yep. debris with him. Yeah, yeah. And then for support, got uh, Epsilon Ace in his tie FO <laughs> with advanced optics. So nine, seven, four, be... twelve. <laughs> yeah, four or twelve, depending yeah. on uh, how he's feeling at the time, you know. Okay. Riding high at the start of combat oh, or being man. low at the end. And then I decided I was going to fly something at this point, which something feels almost old school. It's last wave. <laughs> uh, but something that's been in my head for a while. Uh, I haven't really had a chance to fly it yet. So here we go. Uh, it's Nimmin Sixa. Woo! So um, I got uh, Captain Nim, Long Range Scanners, Havoc Title, Veteran Instincts, Auto Blaster Turret, Accuracy Corrector, 
extra munitions, R4E1 prox mine, cluster mine, and harpoon missile. Full load on NIM. There are literally no free, no free slots there. It's all NIM. Uh, and then Soul Sixa, uh, backing them up, long range scanners, veteran instincts, twin laser turret, extra munitions, CAD Bane, uh, bomblet generator, ion bomb, and harpoon missile. And uh, I'm hoping to explode at least one of Valley's ships before we get too serious here. And uh, Valley just stepped away for a moment, so I'm going to continue to yabber on for a bit here. I am actually 98 points. I think Bally's list is 100 points. 100 points. All right, so there we have it. I'm going to... Oh, it doesn't matter. We don't actually overlap. I'm going to take an 4, initiative. 4, 12, 7, yeah. 9. Yeah, and I'm 10 and 8. Yeah. Be, uh, so I'm going to take initiative. I'm going to place the first rock right there, sir. And make sure that that's clear on that side, and that's good on that side. There we go. And then I'm just going to switch us over to the lists here. Give me a moment. I'll put this big old chunk of debris right here-ish. There we go. That's got us in on there. Okay, and you're going to put that one there? I'm going to put it over here. Okay. Think of something on a Jedi? I have no idea why Watto is in my head, but uh, yeah, I'll take it. Okay. You do realize you just quoted a line from the movie which shall not be talked about. You know what? There are some redeeming features to that movie, but it doesn't need to be watched to fit the rest of the story in. As far as I'm concerned, Machete Order could hack uh, uh, number one off completely and replace it with Weird Al's The Saga Begins and still be just as complete. Yeah, well, it, that that song does cover <laughs> exactly like and, the whole thing. And honestly, I find it far more entertaining than the movie. Oh, so. yeah. Yeah, it is. <laughs> so I'm an 8 and a 10. So oh, yeah, your so 7 is going to place my first. My 4 is going to place uh, first. No, he's actually a, considered a 12 from Even right outside. Now? Yeah. Really? Interesting. Just as if he had VI and had pushed a six or whatever. He's a twelve. All right. Can't say I've ever really used him. I know, right? Like, but sometimes when I'm like, oh, how, what am I going to fill twenty points with? Oh, here we go. Pop. Why not? Oh, where to put this actually obnoxiously to, large tie? I actually used to field him quite a bit when uh, first order stuff first dropped. Alright, so here we got Soul Sixa at PS8. Um, I'm gonna set up down here, I think. There we go. Alright, there you go. You got Wispa. You know, the great thing about these guys, they don't have to work anywhere near each other together. No, they don't. They just work. Oh, Agent Callus. Oh, yes. Start of the first round. Okay. Not during placement. Okay. Okay. And the Nim. Nim, 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 Nim. Just going to tuck in there behind Soul Sixa. So keep in mind, Nim is the tall one. Not actually sure if that's canon or not, but I'm sticking with it. Well, certainly not a slim nim. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. This is a fat, like, eats his chunky soup with a fork type nim. He had his Wheaties this morning. Yep. <sighs> 
Ooh, ooh, I'm really double thinking these long range sensors though. I, I didn't really like them when I used them. The yeah, they can Thursday. be useful, especially on uh, um, uh, weapons that don't make you spend your target lock. Because mm -hmm. then you have a target lock and a focus for when you shoot. But it can be difficult to get those target locks uh, mid to late game when everybody's like range two and closer. We'll see if I regret that and end up going with guidance chips on these guys or something. I really do. I don't even know what I'm doing for placement. I just. I know, you just put some chips down. Alright, oh, so now we'll set some dials. Typical valley night here. <laughs> You're gonna do fine, buddy. You're gonna do fine. That blackout is gonna be surprisingly brutal. <laughs> That gonna, the dial is so insane. You're going to alpha him so hard. I hope to, but I don't know <laughs> if I'm going to get close enough to get him. Okay, I think I got my skirt dials down. I just got to remember that my barrel rolls don't bank. Mm -hmm. like no so banking barrel Star rolls. Yeah. <laughs> so much of that Star Viper. You're going to cheat. Make it serious. Hmm. Hmm. Where the heck am I going to come at you from here? Well, second guessing myself already. Uh, that whisper going out on the flank is. That's bothersome. I mean, your 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 silencer can kind of handle go taking the point. It's kind of the point of the point there. Kind of a pointy ship. Okay, I think I'm ready. You're ready. Sure. Okay, let me get this timer started, <laughs> and we can get on with the beat down. Try silencer. Think right too. All right. And good luck to you, sir. Good luck to you. Okay. And I'm going to take focus. God, that just looks awesome, even. That's you. Oh, yeah. Um, Soul Six, uh, forward four. There we go. Yeah, it is a pretty awesome ship. I love the red uh, cockpit. Yeah, the red cockpit looks pretty dope. And then Soul is going to hiss at you. Not really, no. She's going to try and make you cry with the TTs. There we go. Is that your long range scanner? That's my long range scanner. Alright. Nine. Four, four. Mm -hmm. Yeah, nice fast speed. <laughs> it's so weird. Your little TIE fighter moving at 12. I know! <laughs> My highest, highest pilot talent is that one. And yeah. I'm going to cloak. I forgot to pull my cloak token, so I'll dig that up, and you can go ahead. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Well, I got a cloak token here. Yeah, it's fine. I've got it right here. Okay. Uh, Nim is also going to do a forward four. I just forgot to actually grab it. All right. Man, I think I got a feeling with this new, uh, new wave, I'm going to be all about the gunboats for a long time. Yeah. Oh, I'm man. really surprised, like honestly, very surprised that I'm not currently flying against one. I really thought you would have cracked them open and written up like a half a dozen lists. You know what? I got in, I got working on some stuff, I got uh, doing some housework and setting up the stream, and then I was like, crap, I don't got time. I don't got time. Epsilon Ace does a turn one. As most things in life. There's never enough time. No, there is never enough time. Oh, running away, are ya? So, apparently, Epsilon Ace also goes by the name Sir Robin. Yes. <laughs> Bravely turned his tail and fled. Brave, 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 Sir Robin. 
shouldn't. Okay. I shouldn't have done that. That's okay. But it's, 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 it's a thing. It's, it's a thing. Fine. Don't feel it's bad. Fine. Don't feel bad, bro. Feels bad, man. Okay. Sweet. You know what feels stuff. bad, bro? Harpoon missiles. They feel real bad. Yeah. Yeah, they do. There we go. I'm set. Nope, nope, nope. It's like a guessing again. You're welcome to do that. Nope, I'm good. I'm good. The more I think about it, I'm just like, no, stop it. You're going to crash into a rock and die. <laughs> I'm okay with that, too. I know. Usually you are. Yeah, it's uh, perfectly acceptable. So my, the other list I've been running with these guys is a uh, two lock revenants, uh, both with harpoons, auto blasters, and extra munitions and guidance chips, mm -hmm. uh, and a jumpmaster contracted scout with uh, intelligence agent and uh, feedback array. Hmm. It has been ridiculously good fun. People always look at the scout and they're like, "Oh, that's the bumper. I should stay out of its way." And then I use one of the revenants to get in their way and cause a bump. And they're like, oh, what? He's got munitions. I never saw that coming. Nope, you didn't see that harpoon from the other guy coming either, did you? <laughs> I'll say this. It is not the same as the triple jump masters with guidance chips, dead eye, and torps before. No. But it's pretty damn fun still. Auto blaster can betray you right. when you least expect it to. I fought against Darth Otaku in a match that I recorded but haven't gotten a chance to uh, finish editing yet. Got at him boxed in his whisper on a rock uncloaked. Or was it? No. He didn't decloak. He was cloaked and on a rock. You good? Yep. I had two guys, range one with auto blaster. Got a single hit through. Oh, wow. That's it? I was expecting to erase him, and so was Darth Otaku. So he was very, very surprised when Whisper flew off of that rock and managed to do stuff. I'm surprised he didn't advance sensors at first. Well, don't be. Rolling out, rolling out. Okay, I see what you're doing there. And those are yours, and that's yours. Yeah. Oh, you didn't decloak the didn't. whisper? Nope. Oh. I did not decloak the whisper. Okay. I'm not sure I understand what's going on here. I eat. I don't know if I do yet either. Bank Sorry. three from Soul Sixa. Boop. I'm a boop, ya. Um, Shazbot. I don't even know where you're going. You can, like, take off out here somewhere if you wanted, even. So. Uh, for now, I'm just going to focus, because I don't know what else to do. I was supposed to focus last turn with Epsilon Ace, and I barrel rolled instead. I, supposed to, I forgot I had the stupid relay thing, or not calm relay. The oh, optics. the thing on him, yeah. I can hold my focuses. Okay, and then you're nine. <laughs> uh, yeah. Mm. I know, you're not, we're not used to it yet, right? It's no. all brand new. It's new to me. <clears throat> I'm already making errors. I didn't even know I was going to play this today. I admit it. You have no idea what you're going to play when you get here. Uh, well, sometimes I do. Sometimes I pick my list beforehand or built my list afresh specifically for the flavor of the day. All right, that's fair. And as an action, Whisper will take an evade. All right. Um, I'm also going to do a bank three. Chunk. Oh, 
Okay, uh, Nim. Range three or beyond. So he's gonna shift that QQ to here. That's what I pro well, I probably should have taken the target lock on Whisper with In the first Soul place. as well. That's yeah, fine. It's fine. You're twelve. <laughs> My twelve <clears throat> is gonna do a turn one. Actually, clear. It does, doesn't it? Yep. Right in there. Look at that. Wow. <laughs> now you focus. Leave that. Yeah. Now I focus. <laughs> yeah. After oh my that, god! Oh my god! I fit! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! I fit. That's <sighs> what he said. All right. So end of activation. I get nothing. Okay. Start of combat. 12. Go for it. Any other start of combat shenanigans? Oh, shit. You know what we didn't do? What's that? Shenanigans? Agent Callus. Oh, shit. I Pick wanted it on Nim. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. Callus, Nim. So I don't have the little token thing, but it doesn't matter. Got... It's on Nim. Yeah. Here, I'll just put Agent Callus on top of Nim. Hold on. I got that Callus token here. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, man. Got 50 Bentleys in the West Indies. Uh, there is a range three between the guy you have in the front. I think that was Soul Sixa. Yep. And uh, my Epsilon Ace. So, range three means a mere measly, weak, pathetic little two dice. Don't know where my is. Don't worry about it. Don't worry we about it. We already know. We know. Don't worry we know. about it. Um, so... Oh. Gonna spend it? Nope. I'm gonna sit on gonna it. Gonna sit on it. All right. Yeah. One hit. All right. I get two because range. Yep. And there's. Uh, I'll spend take it. it or eat it. I'll take it. I'll eat one. Okay. I got five, four more where that came from. Okay. That's twelve. Ten. Ten. So I'm gonna drop that. Yep. So I'm gonna drop my first crew, uh, harpoon missile on you. Four dice. You're going to get way too many. I'm going to get four. Plus an evade token. And you got that evade. You could shrug all of this off and I'd be very sad. Ooh. Okay, so let's t uh, spend the target lock to reroll all of that. Oh my god. Yeah, guidance chips are better. So a single crit. There you go. I avoid it. Wow, okay, note to self, long range sensors, not worth it. Damn. I got no shots. Nope. No, no further shots. Soul Eight. Sixer? Soul. Range three or range three of structure. And you didn't have to spend nothing. Yeah, I'm going to take it on Epsilon. Okay. Three dice primary. Blanks. Blanks I'm gonna spend the focus to turn that up one for one. He did it. Damn it! Darn tootin'. Okay, sweep. And seven meters. Yeah, because long range sensors keeps me from taking target locks at close to range one to two as well, so. Yeah. Probably not the best thing to have put on them. I think guidance chips might be a way better option for them. I think so. Oh, I don't know why I didn't think of that. What's that? I could have cancelled all my dice and given myself two hits with the accuracy, accuracy corrector. corrector. Ah, too late. AC. Too late. Okay. 
Okay. I'm as good as I'm gonna get. A D cloak. Yep. Seven goes first. Yep. Reveal a turn two. Oh, my. Oh, my, my, my. Oh, my. And then I will barrel roll. Yeah, because you don't got to spend that gall dang focus. Okay, go ahead. Okay, soul six, huh? It's gonna go forward four. And get probably a little annoyed at that all dang TIE fighter. Uh, he's gonna focus though. He's got a job to do, damn it. Mm -hmm. There's money on the line. Phantom is gonna do a turn one. And then gonna do the damnedest to achieve arc. Oh, you don't think you'd get arc? Well, I don't know where he's going. I uh, know. Hell, I don't even know where he's going, really. Yeah, you do. You know approximately where he's going. I have an idea. If you didn't, there'd be a problem. I'm gonna regret that. I hope so. Done. Okay, Nim, Talon roll three. Thanks there. Uh, I receive a stress. Uh, R4E1 says, that's fine, you can still drop bonds. So, I'm going to drop a cluster mine. Get you with one. That one. Oh. Shit! Dude, just leave the token up! You know it's hitting right me! There. I just wanted to show that it was gonna Just ruin off. everything on the board, why don't you? Freaking guy. Now, on the bright side for you, you get a wicked shot on him. One hit. One hit. Uh, Cad Bane. Will trigger to make you uh, force reroll the. I don't think flex. you should be allowed to knocking two of my ships over <laughs> like that with your careless placement. Hey, clumsiness is okay. Too bad. There you go. Clumsiness is my thing, I guess. All right. <sighs> End of activation. Start of combat. No, I still have this. Oh, activation. sorry. Yeah, no, sorry. Not used to somebody going after Nim. And I'm going to collide. Oh. I'm actually grateful. Perfect. Now it's start of combat. Yep. Uh, Nim is going to shoot no, at. Not. Huh? Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, you're right. You're so right. Uh, it goes through the. over the bomb, doesn't it? Oh, no. I it don't doesn't. have arc. You don't? Nope. Mm, yeah, hold on. Hold on. I swear you did. Nope. I don't have arc. 
So yeah, kill me with your auto blaster. Okay. I'm yep. dead. I can't stop it. You have accuracy. Uh, yeah, I cancel it for two. Wait. I only did one to you. Did you I? did oh, no, two I did with two. Ken That's Bane! Right. That's right. Sorry. <sighs> Sorry. I forgot about... Pay attention! <laughs> okay. Uh, eight. Shit. I'm going to TLT your blackout. It's going to... Yeah, two hits. Versus my dice. Avoided. Yep. And second volley. Uh, two hits. Auto thrusters. Auto thrusters, and I'll spend the evade. Or the focus. spend the focus. There you go. <sighs> okay. And then now you get to just throw the match. First freaking round of freaking real exchange fire, and I lost whisper before you shoot. You do have an obstructed shot, shot on Nim. I get nothing. Oh, I get one evade result because you're shooting through a rock, uh, through that. That's all I get. So I get a bonus one for obstruction, a bonus oh, no. one for uh, from the trick shot. To up to two fewer defense dice, eh? Jesus. So range, range two. Range two. So I would normally get one for normal and my one for um, uh, for, obstruction. For obstruction. Both of those go away, but I do get the one free result because you're measuring through that uh, bomb. And I have nothing anymore. So one hit. Oh, hold on. Do oh, wait, I... wait, wait, wait. Don't you have something in there? First order vanguard. You may reroll one attack die. I know I had something in there. There you go. One so of those. One attack die. So you got two focuses and a hit. And two another hits. hit. Two hits. And Nim is... Take one. Two sheets. Oh yeah, take one because of the one in the belt. Alright. Uh, sweep and set. that awesome show with him, I don't know where to put him now. That was embarrassing for the Phantom. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of sorry, guy. Didn't mean to wreck your Phantom so hard. I saw an opportunity, and I felt I had to try and take it. I thought I would end up putting them... Um, in a row that would block you for next turn and not end up overlapping you. I thought the whole idea of them nerfing genius was to stop that sort of thing and you just switch your your it astromech. It costs so much more on But you just though. swap your astromech and you get basically the same effect. Kind of. I don't... I know it costs more, but... It, it costs more it's and essentially I can't do it on reveal. I, it, and, it's, and it consumes my action. Now, the only bright side there is that with R4E1, you can still do the action at, with your stress. So. Ah, oh, man! That's the wrong dial. That's the wrong dial. So sorry about that, guys. I didn't notice that the uh, overlay seemed to have, seemed to have stalled in the transition there. Um, so I fixed that, and it should be back up. Uh, oh, you're.
or seven, I guess. Yeah. Um, advanced sensors. No, what the deuce? Mm, I guess I put the stupid tile down, so that's it. No, no, it's fine. Dude, cash game. Take it back if you want. You're never committed till you're committed. Is this still going to work with my chosen maneuver? Oh. Oh. Not what I expected. Oh, boost. So then I reveal, and it's a turn one. Ooh, I think I might have gone too far to do what I want to do now. Oh, well. Okay, um, Soul Sexa doesn't have any weird shenanigans. On Reveal is going to drop a bomblet. Boop. And actually, sorry, when she drops, she can use the turn template. Oh god, I'm not going to though. I'm just going to pop it straight out because I don't know what direction you're going. All right, and then she's going to do her talent roll three. Which, uh, I'm sorry, we're going to have to template your um, epsilon ace here to get her out. she I actually have no idea what soul six's gender is could be a she could be an it it is Star Wars okay and then oh I guess uh, 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 no. who's gonna do a bank two drop my stress uh, action is gonna be to drop a box mine not close enough. Hopefully you're going to shoot me. Yeah, you have to shoot through it at least, so that's something. Okay. And then sloop to Ooh, that was a good guess, Dickus. That was. There's a good literally guess. not a single maneuver I could possibly make that would put me out of range of that bomb. Oh, I, don't you have like a forward five? Yeah, but where's the forward five going to land me? Look, uh, in bomb. Yeah, range. you could probably there barrel roll from that too. But, nothing. Uh, I see. Uh, I see what you're getting at. I see. I was going to eat that bomb once you decided to drop it. At least you're still focused. Uh, end of activation, the bomblet goes off, and your dude rolls. Uh, Reroll the focus, please. For one hit. Not enough! Nope. Nim's got no shot. I have no shot, you mean. Oh, yeah, sorry. Your guy has, has no, no shot. shot. Nim has no shot. Soul Sixa is... Oh, man. Primary or TLT? I know, right? Range two... I'm going to TLT. First volley. Uh, three hits. And that's a hit. Okay. And second volley. Uh, one hit. And then that's not a hit. So one hit. Now you're at four? Now I'm at four. Oof. Okay, so that's range... Two. Yep. So I'm going to yep. get my result because you have to measure through, and I get one. Oh my god. Could be one of those nights again. Maybe. We'll see what happens in the second We're half. We're already seeing it happen. Where's my other stupid dial?
Okay. Wait, no. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. I'm ready now. You ready now? Really ready now. Epsilon. Epsilon. Turn two. Shed stress. Oh, nice. I was expecting some advanced sensor shenanigans. And I focus up. Okay, uh, Soul Sixa is looks like a bump. Smells like a bump, and it's a bump. Does that look about right? Right there. There you go. Um, I clear my stress at least. Yay! Okay, and then Nim is going to do a hard turn two. Oh, heck yes. I may not be able to bomb you, but at least I can auto blaster you. Um, okay. End of activation. Start of combat. Nim uh, auto blaster accuracy corrector. And then Soul. Because that's still on you, right? Okay. Soul is going to drop her harpoon. And yada! Uh, that's not bad. I'm going to spend the. Oh, that was a hit. Uh, spend the target lock to reroll that one into a focus. So three hits. And I take two. And it's out of range two, so you still get auto thrusters. Okay, so I take one. Yep. And you are harpooned now. Uh, okay, that's that for my guys. Uh, you got a shot back here. That's Saul. I'm not honestly sure that I do. Oh, yeah. That one will be just, but yes, it is. So range three, I get two. I roll, and I get to re-roll one. Oh yeah, because Vanguard. Because I don't have a shot. No, you him. don't. Nice. So re-roll that. Ah, oh. spend the focus for two hits, and I get uh, nothing. Take two on Soul Six. Uh, boo -boo. Okay. Uh, your four doesn't have a shot. Where the heck am I going now? Um, Kylo Ren and Quick Draw would be like. I'm starting to think that. Um, you ready? Yeah. BI might be better on this guy than Trick Shot.
Okay. And then seven. Um, uh, oh, ooh. Oof, oof, oof. I don't think you care. Go ahead. Okay. Um, Soul Sexa on reveal drops a bomblet. Says if you got Cad Bane in a bomblet generator and you're not dropping bombs, you're doing it wrong. And then she's going to do her Talon roll three and regret. Nothing? Probably nothing. Okay. And then Nim. Wow. Forward four. Uh, Proxmine, which uh, is... Oh my god. Might not actually overlap. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Proximity mine just misses. <laughs> oh, shit. That's insane. Okay. Um, end of activation. Bomb goes off. Uh, Epsilon rolls for the damage. There. Hmm. Um... Nim's gonna auto blaster for two. Auto blaster accuracy corrector. And then you get to shoot four dice because you're too close for me to TLT here. Ooh. You're last to shoot, so you may as well. And Nim gets one, woo, and takes two hits and a crit. Uh, three, one shield left. Wow, Nim with the bomb dropping is still, still brutal. I was not expecting him to be as efficient as he still is. Come on, you brought tons of meta to the table. Give me a break. Yeah. Nim and a bomblet generator with Cad Bane on the other guy. And yeah, but usually, usually it's Nim with the bomblet. And people You're up doing against really TIE Fighters so. and you selected a list that has an auto blaster accuracy corrector. Come on. I Okay, you're right. I'm sorry. Don't be surprised that you're slaughtering the shit out of me. Flying a list that's never been flown before. A ship we've never tabled before. Nope. Move first, isn't it? Like it matters. Yeah, sorry. Um, uh, What happens with harpooned again when you hit people? Only when crits happen. Everybody at range one takes a damage. And then you take a damage. And then it falls off. You only get harpooned once, and then it falls off. It's not repeatedly, thank goodness. I can't believe how freaking close that all dang prox mine is and that ladies and gentlemen is why this ship is a small base and not a large base
do it to it, my friend. <laughs> All locked together. Apparently, that was in the middle of those foils. Yeah. Foiled! Foiled. Wait, why did you do a hard turn to start? Oh, that was your maneuver. Okay, sorry. It's okay. a maneuver? <laughs> No, I, I, sorry, you reveal I thought a you, were, you reveal I thought a template. You were, I thought you were boosting at first. I thought you were boosting at first. No. It's advanced answers, but. No, I was not boosting at first. Barrel rolling first, though. There. Okay. Uh, Soul Sixa is going to fly away. And oh shit, should have dropped a bomb too late. I've already moved my maneuver. Damn it! Oh, damn it! Take my focus then. Maybe I can TLT it to death instead. Um, Nim's going to do a. Oh shat. Talon three over the rock? I meant to do that way. Oh no. No, 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 no. Alright, so I'll roll for damage and take a hit. And that's shields down on him. And then he's stressed. And yeah, that's Nim. That's my Nim trick. Okay. Nim has no shot. Um, it's called a primary weapon. Out of arc. Oh my gosh, you are out of arc. Uh, or I are Soul arc. is going to try to TLT you. Uh, no, not those. There we go. Uh, so, first volley. Um, one hit. One hit. Auto thrust. <laughs> Second volley. Uh, two hits. Auto uh, thrusters and one. Unless. Oh, Vanguard! I may discard this card to reroll all my defense dice. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice. This is lethal otherwise. Yeah. I have one. And auto, and thrusters. auto thrusters. Nice. Survive it. I no longer have Vanguard. Uh, okay. And range two back at Soul Sixa. Yep, I get one. And it's two crits. Ooh, thank God I got a couple shields still left. I'm going to evade one and take one. Sweep. Sweep and set. Crap. first buddy admittedly VI might not be a bad idea it puts him up high enough on the pilot stack that he can start responding to things <sighs> seven is just a smidge too low for his his ability in my opinion See, now you're starting to figure him out. He's still alive. Him, I'm actually having no problem with I know, right I now. know. All right, uh, there you go. So, oh, yeah, sorry, on, on reveal, drops a bomb, but <laughs> not that it's going to matter. Because <coughs> it's probably too far away. No, I think that's still in range. And then does a forward one. And we'll focus. And then Nim is going to do a bank two and clear his stress. And we'll 
we'll take that target lock with the uh, long range scanners now that you're outside of range. Yeah. Oh, no way. Damn. Yes, please. Free roll. Just one, right? Both. Up to two. I quit. It's over. And you Done. take a crit. You ain't dead That's yet, good. buddy. Yeah, dude. Four hull. Oh, four hull. Never mind. You're right. That's it. Damn. Done. Thank you, I guess, for being a punching bag. Seems to be my calling card these days. Uh, I, I roll shit. You ace every attack I throw it. Well, almost every attack I throw at you. Uh, yeah, this was... You're right. This was a very lopsided confrontation, and I'm terribly sorry about that. Yeah, not really sure why you picked a metal disc against me. Because it, it's something I happen to have here. It was either that or, like, my A-wings that were built. So, um, yeah. Damn. That, that tie is pretty freaking cool, though. That's, it is. I like it. Vanguard, um, at least, was pretty handy. Yeah, I love the ability to discard the title and re-roll your entire defense. That was cool. Like, it's a one shot, but I, it saved my life right there. Yep. Only for one round, but it saved my life right there. <laughs> yeah. You know, that that is a cool title. The fact that it grants you combat or attack re-rolls until you need to use it to defend. Yeah, exactly. And it's limited in how often it allows you to perform those re-rolls. But yeah, it you, does allow you to perform rerolls. It gets you what you what you need in the clinch, yeah. which is what you needed right when that happened. Yeah. Yeah. I can't believe what happened to my whisper. I yeah, I, I saw you push in like that, and I was like, "Holy shit! I I gotta I gotta do this thing with with Nim." And, and it dropped my bomb at just the right time. I'm surprised you pushed in with Whisper the way you did. I was expecting you to push Whisper out and around and get the flame. I didn't exactly... And make me chase this guy around I didn't around exactly push in with Whisper. I mean, it was the slowest maneuver possible, and I was <laughs> coming up around here. I know, like, I know. I was really expecting you to come more forward. I wasn't expecting the Talon roll in here. I okay. always forget about that stupid, cheating, fucking... <laughs> Astromech droid that allows you to drop bombs on stress. Uh, R4E1 and that, is, is OP. That killed me. That one thing. Yeah. That's what killed me. I, I think bombs. with Not some more shot. practice and and with some more practice uh, against this Nim build, you'd probably do fantastically better, sir. Yeah. So far, and, the, so far as the only real you... use I've seen out of Whisper, um, I mean, it, with that up, having an up shuttle to support it or something like that to give the extra yes. actions, that's... Huge. huge. Um, I realize I forgot about Callus on my defense, but it doesn't. No, oh, it doesn't. It doesn't yeah. matter because you were using auto blasters. Oh, that's right. Yeah, that. Bombs that went straight Nothing I can do auto against blasters. auto blaster and the bomb with Cad Bane forced the rerolls, and there's no evade option for it. It's just nope. either you rolled it or you didn't, and that's it. That's why I really felt I had to take that risk to get that talent roll and hopefully drop those bombs on you. I was honestly thinking that I'd talent roll and drop them in a line here, and then you'd come, ac uh, come across them trying to get out. Um, I didn't expect you. I didn't expect my talent roll to put me back far enough that I could drop it here and actually get you with one. Oh well, game over. Yep. Moving along. Well, I, um, I think we're going to take a short break. Um, literally, just a short break. Uh, I'm going to take enough time to pee and make some coffee real quick. When we come back, I will be unboxing all of my ships, and then we're going to try and build that uh, bomber list or something akin to it uh, so that you can see uh, what sort of tactical advantage we might have been given for the evening. Something akin to it being keywords there. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. We, we might be able don't to proxy have the ships to do the. We might be able to proxy with uh, bases and, and fudging stuff, but I'm, I always feel weird about proxying an entire ship. Yeah, the it ship just feels itself. awkward. Um, but we'll figure something out, and we'll we'll discuss it live on stream while we do so. Indeed. All right, guys. So uh, those of you watching along on the archive, don't forget like and subscribe. Leave some comments. Go check out our Patreon, Patreon.com/slash Tech Industries. Uh, get, you have an option there to either give us a tactical advantage or to pick up some Ewok insurance. Both of those are a great value. Uh, and of course, coming up on the 16th, there is a Q4 kit tournament at uh, Skyhaven Games. So be sure to check that out. 10 to 4 
uh, in conjunction with our good friends at Black Moon Squadron. So there will be some Black Moon Squadron prizing uh, there, uh, as well as the regular Q4 kit uh, prizing. Nice. Bally, do you have anything you want to say? Nope. All right. Well, then, thanks, guys, and we'll see you here on the map.